What is up you guys? So it is almost close to peak week. We are two weeks out from the show. I'm at my lovely home gym, my apartment gym. Look at that view. This is what motivates me every day is being able to see this nice and early in the morning. But I wanted to do a quick check-in. I was in the middle of doing cardio. People were in here and I got really bad anxiety because I just have awful anxiety um, to film. So I was on the treadmill for like 10, 15 minutes and then as soon as they left, I hopped off to film this intro. So today we are doing cardio, then I'm gonna head to work and then when I get off, we are going to do some like glutes and some, some legs. Abs are looking fairly good. I haven't eaten, so we're doing fasted today. So we're gonna be doing 35 minutes of cardio on the treadmill, which like I said, I've already completed 10. But, so we're getting our treadmill in. Incline of 14, speed 3.5. I did my first five minutes as a run because that's what we've been doing lately. Oh my God, filming and talking is exhausting. Um, how do fitness girls make vlogs cute? Like they look so aesthetically pleasing. No, I have, I'm just, yeah, all of that. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm starving, I'm tired, I'm out of breath, and I am going to continue this video after the cardio. Okay, so we just finished our cardio session, and I'm starving, so we are about to go eat our breakfast. My breakfast is going to consist of oatmeal and a protein shake. So exciting. Not really. But I'm happy that I get carbs right after my workout because that really helps me go throughout the day. Um, tomorrow's check-ins. So tomorrow is actually what marks my two weeks. Um, and we do check-ins tomorrow. So I might include that in this video. We shall see. But I feel like I've leaned out really well. I'm excited with the last two weeks, what peak week is going to have in store. I have a super busy day at work today. So I think this is gonna conclude our video or maybe I'll add more, we'll see. We'll see where this takes us for today. But I just thought, I kinda wanna blog this experience for myself because it has honestly, the past eight to 10 weeks have just flown by and I didn't think I was gonna make it this far and we did. Um, the body transformation has been amazing and this whole experience has been honestly amazing. But my energy level, it's kind of not there mainly because of you know working out and having to work full time and never really knowing what I'm getting off of work so my day-to-day -day is very inconsistent so I'm just trying to get as much rest and sleep at night that we can but yeah that kind of sums up for today I might include check-ins for tomorrow so let's see where that takes us Okay, so today is Friday. So today actually marks official two weeks. Um, I know we kind of vlogged on Thursday, so I kind of jumped ahead and got really excited, but I submitted my check-ins and everything looks good. It is that time of the month, so I'm a little bit bloated. Um, so we have increased cardio dramatically. I was doing about like 35 minutes and now we're going to one whole hour. I'm literally like screaming in my head right now. Not excited, but there has been some movies I've been wanting to see and I'll have plenty of time to do that on the treadmill. Plenty of time. So I just finished my work day and all of my meals have been, well, my meals are going to be updated. She said she, she, said she was going to update the meals um, this weekend. So it's Friday. So they should be updated probably by Monday, which I'm really curious what's going to change. I feel like I'm pretty cut right now. I mean, we start with like oatmeal, we have a protein shake, chicken and rice, protein shake, uh, tilapia and rice, and then maybe a protein yogurt 
and some almonds. So I feel like I don't have a whole lot of food. I'm wondering if she's gonna cut some of the carbs out. I'm allowed like a little bit of avocado, so maybe we'll cut the fats out. But I don't know, because we only have like 35 grams of fat. So I'm really curious what Monday has in store for us. Um, but yeah, we are going. So today, I technically only have to do the 35 minutes. The 60 minute cardio starts tomorrow for Saturday. So today we have our 35 minute cardio and some abs. Uh, yeah, I can't wait to be extremely tired and emotional because today I was already super emotional, not because of like anything, just like hormones are out of whack that time of the month. I'm, you know, hungry. I'm tired. Work is kicking my ass. Oh my God. My job is extremely demanding. And if you are going to go into prep or, or want to do a competition, I mean, I know work is like naturally super stressful right everybody has stress at work i get it but make sure you're on like a timely schedule because there are times where i just i'm like if i don't want to get up and go to the gym instantly like wake up and go i don't really have the option at night i mean i do but who wants to do an hour cardio at eight o'clock i'm tired i'm ready for bed i've been working so i'm really trying to you know take my rest and get up early and just get it done but that's also a task in its own. So either be an early bird or a night owl with my career path of choice. And, you know, right now it's busy season. Um, so I'm like super booked out. And for example, at seven o'clock, this is considered me leaving work early. Like the sun's out. This is like a timely manner to leave work and I'm about to go work out. Um, but typically it would be like an 8.30 time frame, and we're going in at 10 a.m. So it has been extremely exhausting like if you're gonna want to do prep make sure you have time or else you're gonna be like me and complaining that there is not enough time in a day whatever so i think that's enough of my ramble i've been rambling for three whole minutes it's a long time to ramble but anyway i have the clip inserted of my prep my bikini came in my bikini came in um didn't uh, oh, I love the bikini. Love my bikini. Didn't love it on me because I'm so bloated. But I know, here's a good thing. We have two weeks, so I started now, which means show day is going to be, like, extra snatched. Um, and I don't have to worry about accidentally starting. And I feel bad for girls who maybe do start their period on, like, stage day. Bless your heart. Not going to be me, but I just, I, I could not imagine. Um... So I'm just drinking a lot of amino acids and, you know, heating pad, all that kind of stuff. Um, but yeah, that, I guess we'll conclude our TED Talk. Somebody moved this bike awfully close because I used to have a lot of space for filming here. But regardless, we are on Tuesday. I think I last checked on, checked in with you Friday. I have a lot of congestion. So a lot is going on in the nasal passages. So I took a Sudafed. I am so tired. We upped cardio to an hour and we are still doing weights. But just in a couple of days, I've noticed so much change in my physique from like Thursday, Friday to Tuesday. We are on all fish pretty much. Um, so really low carbs, like oatmeal, maybe like a cup or two of rice, and then just straight protein pretty much. Like low carbs, very, very high protein. We cut calories. So just in a couple of days, I feel, I don't know, a lot more lean. I feel like the abs are a lot more defined. We are about to, I'm gonna break up my workout. We're gonna do 30 minutes of cardio, incline to 12, speed 3.5, and then we'll do 30 minutes tonight with weights. Um, I'm about to go to work, so I'm about to start this cardio, but I just thought I'd update y'all. I also did my first photo shoot yesterday, and it was oh so exciting, and I'll probably drop some of those photos after this, but I just wanted to sign off and let y'all know how I'm feeling. I feel like my legs are getting stronger. I feel like my core is getting stronger. Um, again, this bike is all up on me, but or maybe I'm all up on the bike. Um, also, I feel like, I don't know. My butt is 
obviously smaller than when I started. Like I've worked my ass off, literally. But I feel like it's more muscular. Like even in the photo shoot photos, I've never had a muscle butt before. So we're gonna end it with that.